It is the 1st of the 12th, 2011, and um, it's like almost 2 o'clock in the morning, uh, but I wanted to do this video while everything was still fresh in my head. Now, let me begin by saying I am not part of the Occupy movement. I don't consider myself one. I am a part of the Truther community here on YouTube, which I am exclusive to. You will only find me here. Um, feel free to share my videos anywhere in the world. I, I, I have no problem with you sharing my information at all. Um, I went with some reservations due to the foundations of the Occupy movement. Um, Truther Girls did an ex outstanding video um, detailing the beginnings of the Occupy Wall Street movement and how it was how it was originally started. Uh, called out by two socialist newspapers owned by one of the major media moogles. And so I went down there thinking, eh, what's going on down here? You know, a bunch of socialists. But come to find out, um, they're pretty much everyday folks, just like you and me. Uh, most of these people work. Um, the camp was not full, to even say the least, during the daytime, because most of these people have jobs and lives, and, and they're supporting every way that they can. Uh, even though they can't physically physically be down there um, in the cold with these people. I found that the homeless was a minority. I'm talking a very, very, very few. Um, these people are well fed. Uh, these people are insulated and they're ready to deal with the cold. Uh, all true-hearted Iowans, um, you know, we, we're used to this kind of weather. But uh, they don't have their camp to set up because the, the city's making them stay to code and the inspector is down every day to make sure that there's frost still on the top of these tents because they're not allowed open flame heaters of any kind. Uh, they've got some heat lamps up in the main tents uh, to kind of break away the cold a little bit, but uh, they're just those heated light bulbs uh, like they do for food. Um, so they're making do with what they got. Uh, and they're having to follow the rules because the officials are there um, almost every day. I didn't see one when I approached. Uh, there was a reporter for the City View, which is a local free paper here in Des Moines. And uh, as soon as she puts out her report, I'll definitely comment on that. Because she was just bringing up, you know, she was digging dirt. Well, how many people, are there any fights? Or how many homeless people are here? How many people spend the night? And who are you and why are you here? And... Blah, blah, blah. So she was getting in, she was trying to dig up as much dirt as possible, in my opinion. Um, but again, you know, and she, you know, I was, a, anyway. So, um, I got to know some people, and basically what's going on in Des Moines is that the mayor is pissed off at the governor, and he's allowed the occupiers to stay at a little city park, uh, pretty much up against the project. Um, special housing uh, units overpacked with um, underfed kids um, in a very rough part of Des Moines downtown uh, right across the street from uh, the federal or the, the state complex of buildings and um, these people pull security every night uh, I was told about a shooting last weekend a domestic dispute small caliber fire and a car speeding up the wrong way down a major one-way intersection here in Des Moines and these are the things that the people that these people have to deal with but they're all in it together and they all look out for each other and, and, and it's working very well for them uh, respect for that um, I find that most of the occupiers that I talk to um, were just waking up and they weren't on the same page as most of us on the truther movement or the truther community and um, they're just kind of getting the grasp of, of what's going on, but they don't quite see the big picture yet. And I tried to explain a few things to a few people, and I, th I think I confused some of them, or, or maybe even alarmed a few enough to come check out who is this guy. Well, come check me out. Um, I didn't tell you what my real name was. I, I, my, my name is Magic here on, in the community. I don't give out my real name or real email addresses or phone numbers or nothing like that. Um, due to security reasons here on YouTube, you put up your face and, you know, there's all kinds of people watching these videos, so you got to be careful. And that's why I was uh, pretty adamant about my, 
my secrecy on my identity. If you do know who I am, I please ask you respect my personal privacy um, as far as the crazy world we live in. And if you want to communicate with me personally, please send me a private message via YouTube and I will respond to you and answer any questions. So, good meeting. I did record and cover that. Uh, they went out and held up the signs in the corners for me for a little while. And I got the horns honking. I'll put up a video on that later. Um, other than that, all I can tell you is these are everyday people trying to figure out what's going on. Uh, they're organized. They're determined. And uh, they're not going away, even if you evict them. So, good luck, guys. I'm fighting with you, but on another battlefield. I'll come down as I can, and I will let you know the next time I come down to visit before I visit, okay? Until then, enjoy what you can, everybody. Thanks.